This article will show you how to remove the charged air intake to throttle body or Y-pipe red arrow. To access it, you will first need to remove the front engine panel blue arrows. Use a pick and slide out the clip red arrow holding the hood release handle to the hood release mechanism. With the clip removed, you can lift the handle straight up and off. Use a pick and lift up on the push pins holding the panel in place, then pull the plastic pins out. Use your hands and pull up the front of the panel out from the connections in the bumper cover, red arrows. The panel will slip forward and out from the connector on the headlight cover, red arrow. Use a T25 torque and remove the three mounting screws, indicated by the red arrows. Next, you will need to remove the front bumper cover. Please follow the link provided at the end of this video for additional assistance with that task. With the front bumper removed, you can access the connections for the pipes to intercoolers, red arrows. You do not need to remove the air shutters or guides, blue arrows. There is a rubber air block, red arrow, between the upper cross member and Y pipe. Simply lift this out. Use a set of hose clamp pliers and remove the connection and separate the hoses beside the throttle body. It is a pinch hose connection on the Y pipe and easier to separate here. Use hose clamp pliers and separate the forward hose from the Y pipe, red arrow. The blue arrow indicates the pinch clamp that connects the other hose to the Y pipe. Use a pick and separate the hose from the Y pipe. Slide out the tab on the map sensor, green arrow, and separate the wiring connection. You can also remove the sensor from the pipe with a 10 millimeter socket, but if you do that, you may damage the O-ring, and at the least, you will need to cover the O-ring with Porsche synthetic gasket seal or equivalent when reinstalling. Use a 7mm socket or flathead screwdriver and loosen the two clamps holding the bellows that connects the Y-pipe to the throttle body, red arrows. You can just separate the bellows from the Y pipe, but if you are removing the white pipe, you are probably trying to access the area for other work. I find it easier to just compress the bellows and remove it completely. Release the plastic clips that hold the end of the air guide, red arrow, and swing both air guides inwards. Use a T25 torque and remove the single upper screw on both sides that hold the charged air pipe to the air guide, red arrow. The foam pieces on both sides are just friction fits and will come off with the pipe. Use a 7mm socket and loosen the clamps on the hose to pipe connection, red arrow. Use a pick to run between the hose and pipe and help break the connection. Gently pull the pipe from the intercooler hoses and remove it from the vehicle. You now have access to the upper cross member, lock carrier, and throttle body. Installation is the reverse of removal. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our channel and check out another video in this series.